Nothing will stand in my way. <laughs> Breathe deep and move. Fight, friend. <laughs> no choice but to keep going. Blood follows me everywhere. Ignis! <laughs> This must be where the gnolls attack. The beautiful broken heap smells oddly enticing. You find you can't resist inhaling her offals. You hear what comes next before you see it. The sharp snapping of bones and a yelp of pain as her body starts to twist and undulate. You watch with cold realization. This isn't the end of one life, but the start of another. Her darling pups will not be of her own species. Knolls bring forth their iniquitous litter from many corpsed wombs, including hyenas. Bones snap as the hyena is hollowed from the inside out, forming a vessel for something new. Her belly splits like a rotten fruit, birthing a frenzy of claws and fangs. The raw hate of life reared from the miracle of death. A tear almost springs to your eye. Day, another fight. <laughs>
right, let's go. Fall by my hand. <laughs> Nothing important is ever easy. Need to find a way forward. Slow down. Ignition! I'll strike you down. Uh. Place is overrun with nulls. Not a good sign that they're bursting to life everywhere. Best to move before the blood draws more of them. Another step forward.
of psychic pain, the pack leader's mind clamps onto yours. You see yourself through her eyes, a pulsing red cluster of organs. Feast. No, a voice has forbidden this meat. Nor will see your whole world as a meal. This voice is acting as a leash, but it won't hold them for long. As the symbol glows, power courses through you. Authority. Deep in the chaos of her mind, something responds to your command. A tadpole. It is the source of the voice. She will obey it. She will obey you. A shiver runs across your mind. You feel sated. hungry pit. The flesh of the survivors wasn't enough to satisfy her. Sensing your presence, the Knoll's tadpole writhes in ecstasy, echoing your command. Its host will feast on Knoll flesh to control the hunger, to keep her teeth from your throat. for peace. Behold, the dance of death. Interesting. The host is dead, but the parasite is still alive. You 
can't craft a chest like that to hold trinkets. There must be something valuable inside. The ox tenses, horns lowered in your direction. His hide twitches, every muscle primed to bolt. He's terrified. The ox calms, his tail swishing a satisfied arc. Someone's moving around in there. spot a man crouching between the shelves, just as he spots you. Bugger! He freezes, waiting on your next word. There's a breeze down here. Wonder where it's coming from.
Bet I can crack that open. That's far enough. What's your business down here? Answer honestly and maybe we'll kill you clean. I won't. Last time. What's your business here? Trade with what? Your life was ours the moment you walked in here. But maybe I'll let you buy it back. I have a job needs doing. We've disarmed the traps. Come down. You don't want to keep Zaris waiting. Believe me. I hope the fist tries to storm in. I want to see those traps in action. Not many can talk their way into a Zentarim outpost. I could use someone with your skills. Interested in a job? Some of our people are missing. More importantly, so is their cargo. Find them. Keep them alive if you can. Failing that, just bring that shipment back. Unopened. God damn it! What about the shipment? The Shaba's black bones, you did it! And still sealed. You're a god's damn wonder. Here's your coin. Actual professionals are rare. You ever want more work? Come and see me in the gate. Our trader can show you some of our more exotic items now. But don't delay. This place is likely to be rubble soon. Someone kidnapped a duke, right on our bloody doorstep. The Flaming Fist will need someone to blame. I don't plan on it being us. <laughs> <laughs> 